Hey everybody and welcome to the next, uh, not next, to the latest um, Glasswings Retold demo build. Uh, this demo has actually been out for a while and this is actually my third attempt of recording it. I've been having pretty bad... Hello phone, how are you doing? Sorry about that. I'm really unprofessional. Left my phone on. So yeah, this is my third time trying to record this. Uh, the first time, I just didn't like the way I recorded it. The second time, my so recording software program crashed and wouldn't record video. So this is my third time, and so I'm going to just kind of speed run through it if I can. Um, and talk about pros and cons, what I like, what I dislike. Uh, if you guys remember, this is the same... From my last uh, playthrough of the the of her demo, and I'm stuttering over my words. Um, the first thing you'll notice is I have changed, I have changed Mayfly's design. Doesn't look like the normal Mayfly. And when we get into a 3D, I'll show you a bit more on that. Um, but yeah, I've changed. There we are. Yeah, I've changed how she looks because, you know, you give me ability to to change how a character looks. I will change how a character looks. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Uh, right target, or Z target, if you want to call it, is very well. The camera moves pretty smoothly. Um, I kind of wish it would stay... Oh, come on. There we go. Uh, this is a new thing. If you're stuck, you hit pause. She has this new help function. And in certain areas, if you wait too long, it will tell you uh, things to do. Now I know some of you guys are going to go, you're going, uh, you're going way too fast. Uh, and that I would say, yes, yes, I am. But again, I have played this. This is my third time running through it. I'm pretty sure I know what I'm doing. Uh, here's another problem I had is in close areas, sometimes the camera glitches out like that. Um, other than that, I mean, the art deck looks great. I love the shading and the detail put into it i just generally generally i just love this game i'm very glad i have found it um this part right here took me forever i really don't know what sh her plan was and how you get up this thing but i just found you come over to this corner you wall jump you wall jump you're up so <laughs> that's how i found out now that area is new. These areas right here are new past the thing. And this is actually how the story, she expects the story to begin. It's like, ah, oh, an earthquake really tore up my bridge. This was my favorite bridge too. Looks like it's sturdy enough to, to go over. Oh good, it looks like Junebug's tree is unharmed. Knowing her, she'll smile when she'll finally see it. Uh, so yeah, so this is how she plans on beginning up oh, her story which I read that because last time if you in the original glass wing how it started was you're just walking around your field all of a sudden that big guy comes down and picks you up and takes you away so uh, this is a new thing she's adding I believed in the early game she had what she called uh, tw um, twilight trials and those were the crystal not the crystal those large open rooms with no Floor, we had to jump from platform to platform. Sometimes there are cogs and spinning platforms, and it was so cool. But this is what she's replacing them. I think she's calling them Dreamscape or Dream Trials. And so, ow, I always hit the fish. I, ow, come on. 
But yeah, but this is what she's, um, ow, replacing those Twilight Trials with. Oh, stop coming out of the floor. Gosh, oh, gosh darn it. Alright, but I really love the look of this. It's very bright and colorful to the eye. Alrighty, here we go. Oh, come on, just get out of my way. Um, but this is the labyrinth or the maze or whatever you want to call it. You're supposed to find parts of your parts of your wings in here and they will give you abilities. Let's see if I can find number one. There's number one. Oh, stop it. Um, there's the big bug. Oh, come on. Oh! Yeah, and this happens quite a bit too. I always somehow teleport after taking some damage. I don't know if it's just because I have the resolution so high or I died, techni technically died. But sometimes it happens, sometimes it doesn't. And it's like, it usually happens when I take damage, I'll just teleport to a random, a random part of the map. And there's two. Let's see if I can remember where three and four are located. Oh, man, goodness. Yep, there's three. Oh, come on. I'm really not good at this. Go, 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 go. Oh, well, oh, nope. Hmm. There's four. Now I got hard luck. I can freeze these guys. There you go down. This is a dead end. Oh, there's another teleport and I didn't even take damage. I wonder if just because the high resolution of frame rate, it can't handle it. And so it skips frames and jumps me like that. There is a lot going on screen. So it could be be anything <laughs> really almost there there he is freeze him I go up look around and I go up and back into the to the 3d world all right now this is the pro this is the place where I had the most trouble one this light and the crystal blends so well. And it is with these guys I have so much trouble with for some weird reason. Oh, 
Alrighty. Like I said, I've played this a lot. This is the room. This in the next room, give me. So much trouble because... And I'll exp I'll show you. Uh, one of the thing the main complaints I had about this game is or about this demo, and it's a little feature. The little thing the things I have complaints on are little. The game, the demo is amazing. I can't wait for the game. I can't wait for it to include everything else. The little thing I hate right now are the cameras. Just a bit. Sometimes it doesn't stay focused, and just how much you move on a little tap. It really affects when you're up on these guys and I'm like, oh, I need to take a step forward and I step almost all the way off. And it's just like, I just try to adjust myself just by a little bit and it's just like, I fall off. And it's like, okay. So it makes it so when landing on these, on these um, dream bugs that I literally have to nail the landing or I fall off. It's like, if I don't nail the landing and stick to it, I'm I'm dead. I fall. I have to restart. Oh, come on, target that one. There you go. And so you literally have to, oh, just nail it first landing. Now later on, I'll show you. There are some of these bugs that you can um you um stick to. Like she has it so when. Not on these guys, but some of the other bugs. She has it when they unfreeze or even when they're frozen. You um automatically get positioned to the center of them and you're balanced there. Which is nice. Like if you're walking on when you're walking on a beam and things like that, uh Mayfly will do that. But she won't do it to these some of these most of these bugs. In this area, most of these bugs you just have to use slide off of, and it's no no fun. No fun at all. And so... That's one complaint I have. It's like, I know it's just one developer working on the game. There we go. Pick up, press E, pick up, press E, pick up. Oh, you went far. I just meant to ch target this stuff, but I guess you can't. And so yeah, so that's just a problem I have is the, the little movements. Like, I bet if you're playing on controller, um, right now I'm playing, I'm, I'm playing with mouse and keyboard. I'm guessing if you play with a controller, it might be a bit better. I haven't tried that yet. I have to get myself a control um, controller. But it's just like... But I mean, if I was a, f a first time player with mouse and keyboard, I like it would be Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, um, didn't really expect that. Uh, as again, these are demos, so um, I can understand them not being uh, perfect. Oh, come on, camera, camera. Um, I can understand these not... Okay. He's not being perfect. Wow, I gotta keep the... Uh... Stone. See that right there. I'm balancing on it. Yet I couldn't balance on the other ones. I don't know if it's only certain types of bugs, because these ones look the same to me. But. Right, come here and get you. But it's like, yeah, it balances. 
uh, which I kind of wish would happen with those other bugs. I mean, when I first played the demo, I got stuck in that in in this room and the last room. Mainly the last room, though, because I couldn't do this. But other than that, I mean, these new creatures are great. They're better than um. I know she's trying to add more than one because in the actual game of Glasswing you only had the one creature that jumped and like this one right here you don't snap until it unfreezes so uh, but I do love these new these creatures of the new mechanic of hey I can freeze them just by looking that is amazing using them as a jumping puzzle Um, it is a great idea, an amazing idea. I I really love it. And after a while, once I get the hang the hang of the mechanic, it becomes really fun. It's just getting the hang of the mechanic and trying to to work it out. I think when I first played, it took me an hour, an hour to get through that. Where here, I just sped run it because I learned. Oh, and these are my favorite. I'm glad you brought these back. I'm speaking as if I'm talking to the developer. But these slides, I really loved in the first game. They were my favorite. Up, up. But these slides were my favorite. I'm glad you're bringing them back. I do miss the whole spinning jump you do. But I understand if you can't do that. But yeah, but that's... But other than that... Other than those, those simple complaints of the of the the minor movement and some of the camera functions, other than that, I love this game. I mean, it is it is a it is a childhood game. It is reminding me of Super Mario sixty four, The Legend of Zelda, but it's also bringing that new new feel into it. Where it's just like the graphics are great. I mean. I'm hoping there's a bit more of the story in this new one. I mean, I know on Facebook the developer was saying that she wished she, there was a way to bring in a bit of the story without um without it seemed like the, the you're um holding the player's hand. Like a lot of these games are literally it's like, oh, press B to do this, press A to do this. If you do this combo, you can do this. Um. If you do need help on introducing character to new moves or giving them hints, um, one way I was thinking by reading some of your stuff is Junebug. Um, you mentioned Junebug in the demo with a tree, and I know you had a, a drawing of Junebug. Uh, maybe as you're traveling trying to get back home and being chased by the demon, maybe Junebug can somehow send you letters. Like with every wing you get... Maybe you can communicate to Junebug through her tree. Oh, and something like that where she's like, oh, now they have this wing. Remember that you can do, you can now do this. Things like that. Um, that's yeah, just an idea though. I mean, I, I, I'm going to play this game no matter what happens. Um, I've been, uh, Nathan from Studio Nathan. This has been Mayfly. Uh, we'll see you all. In the next next time, I bid you all adieu. Bye bye.